Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. The Researcher pane in Word for Office 365 lets you easily insert citations for web articles and other internet content. To use the Researcher pane in Word for Office 365, click the References tab in the ribbon. Then click the Researcher button in the Research button group to open the Researcher pane at the right side of the application window. Then click into the large white search field in the pane. Then type the search term or terms for which you are looking. Then click the search button at the field's right end or press the enter key on your keyboard to find relevant topics and sources within the researcher pane. To return to the previous pane if needed, you can click the back arrow button in the upper left corner of the pane. You can directly click the topics to show more information about them in the pane. To add a heading for a topic to your document, click into the document at the location at which to insert the topic heading. Then click the Add Topic as a Heading button, which looks like a plus sign in the upper right corner of the topic in the Researcher pane. Relevant sources for your search and topic appear below the topics in the Researcher pane. Depending on the results returned, you may be able to click the links that appear at the top of this section, like All, Journals, Websites, or Books, to filter the sources that appear in this list. You can directly click a journal or website link or click the links in the sources for books to either show the content or show options for viewing the website or books information in the researcher pane. You can then click the links that appear to view the source material in Reading View or in a web browser if desired. To add a source as a bibliography citation, click into the document at the location at which to insert the citation. Then click the Add This Source as a Citation button, which looks like a plus sign, in the upper right corner of the source to insert a citation for the source into your document. After inserting a citation, Word asks if you want to create a bibliography. If so, then you can click the Create button to do this automatically in Word from this point forward. Otherwise, click the No Thanks button. You can also check the Don't Ask Me Again checkbox to prevent it from prompting you every time you insert a citation if desired. If you choose to create the bibliography, then in the future it asks if you want to update the bibliography after you insert new citations. You can click the Update button to let Word automatically update your automatically created table of contents. Click the No Thanks button to skip the update. If enabled, note that Word only automatically creates and updates bibliographies in a document if you use the Researcher pane to insert at least one citation in the document. To disable the prompt for automatic bibliography updates if desired, return to the main Researcher pane and then click the Settings button, which looks like a cog, in the lower right corner of the pane. Then click the Researcher Settings command in the pop-up menu that appears to open a window that lets you choose when to update bibliographies and whether to open web pages in Reading View. Make your desired choices and then click the Save button to save them. To close the Researcher pane when you are finished, click the X button in its upper right corner. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www dot teachucomp.com forward slash free.